gonna say that, John? Man, you're I not gonna say you it. You keep bro. calling my bluff. I can say it if you, you stop calling my bluff. If I'm calling your bluff, oh, he's gonna mean, say it. He's gonna yeah, say it. I'm gonna say it. You know, what I'm saying? I ain't gonna hold the pod back. You know what I'm saying? John, man, John only adds to the podcast. He doesn't hold it back. Go ahead, John. If you think you're gonna say it, say the names too and their addresses. Uh, uh, Their VIN uh, number. Uh, relax, 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 relax. He thought he was hard for a relax. second. <laughs> he, hey, relax, he thought he was relax, doing relax. some. Yeah, yeah. It's her middle name. Yeah, you ain't gonna say that. Uh, uh, what she look like? Uh, huh? Exactly. That's cute. She cute. She cute. Okay. okay well, so uh, what happened was, this is New Year's, right? So we went to um, Buckhead. Someone had a condo party last New Year before. So we went there, and one of my homeboys, he knew the dude that was having a spot. We was out there, we chilling, and everything like that. A couple of his homegirls came out of school from downtown, not downtown, but out of town from school. She brought up my homegirls down there. We everything, we getting lit. We drink tequila. Tequila is my weakness. I just tequila, just tequila and John, fine. You know, so she on that part. We over there talking, everything like that. We getting lit. What's about the third? People start leaving. So we was leaving the um, spot. So I had to drop her off because she was like, yo, I'm going to get an Uber. You know me. I'm just like, no, nah, nah, I can drop you off. You're not too far. So I drop her off. She talking about she had a boyfriend and everything, but he's in the military. Oh that, man, you know I like mean? those. <laughs> those. Those are those are the good ones right there. Nah, I felt bad. Those, those are the good ones you right felt there. Bad. Like, yeah, because it's like I'm about to be, I'm about to beat this nigga girl cheeks. And he's serving our country. You know what I'm saying? Like he's protecting me. That was his decision, though. Huh? That was his decision. Yeah, but it's just like man, that boy out there in the desert. I'm in mean, his girl's cheeks. Fact. So I'm dropping her off and everything. I'm thinking about it too because she like she got a man, but now she's like, yeah, you can walk me in. Or you can come out for a little bit. We smoked a little bit. Go in the room. All that boot to boot. So yeah. I'm in there. Boom, boom, beat for a little bit. So at this time, it's like 12 something. After midnight hits, like 12, 45, something like that. So then we move over. So after I beat that chick. You, you f*** that early in the, in the night? Yeah, yeah. I got to get up out of there. She was ready to go. I was ready to go. So the ball dropped. Say, he said so it was before. It was 12. Yeah. Oh, as soon like as the a, ball like, dropped, nigga went right back to the home. Yeah, to <laughs> the home. That's crazy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. No, because the thing was, I was about to look at, <laughs> No, because I wasn't supposed to be at that party that long. I had another function to go to. Mm. I was trying to do both. You know what I'm saying? I was trying to, be, I was I trying to see the ball drop somewhere and then go to somewhere. another second. I hear you, I hear so you. she's there and then she's like, Yeah, I'm about to leave too. I'm tired. I want to go home. I was like, Oh, yeah, I can take you back real quick. Because my friend put up on me on. He's like, Yeah, yeah, John can take you. I was like, John can take you. He's like, Yeah, take her, take her. I was like, oh, yeah, I can take you. I can take you. So I went back, da da da, whoop de whoop. Then the main girl I was talking to before calls. So after I beat that, she calls. So I was like, yeah, I'm about to slide out. He got a boyfriend and everything. I feel kind of bad afterwards. I ain't feel that bad. So I left. <laughs> and then I went to another girl spot right after that. So I beat a girl last year and the new year. Like, sure, the only reason I showed you that because, like, we're not even going to talk no more. They're all back school, and I'm never going to see them again. Uh, that's true. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? But if I'm going to see a girl again, I'm going to respect it and not show her stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't just be showing. You know what I'm saying? Real Of course. But I'm never going to see her again. And then after that, she got a boyfriend. Her boyfriend got, uh, I think. Who gives a fuck? What? We got on- honorably discharged. Honorably? Or what is it? What is it? Honor- yeah, is honorably. it honorably or dishonorably? Oh. This, it can be both. It can be both. What? Yeah. Something. Yeah, he got discharged. So he back home with her now. You know what I'm saying? They got a kid now. So. Wish them nothing but the best. You know what I'm saying? I hope just, you don't watch the podcast. This young, this younger, this younger free. What's her name? Huh? What's her name? Huh? <laughs> you said what? No, that's cool. Anonymous? What you say? Yeah, that's cool. I know. Love's opping right now. That's cool. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. But yeah, be like that. But you know what I'm saying? You gotta, you gotta have fun and keep memories. You know what I'm saying? That's the thing about life. As you grow, then you get older, you can tell your kids this and let them learn from your mistakes. Like my dad be telling me stories all the time about when he was in high school and like that. My dad wasn't a nap player like me. You know what I'm saying? But he was, he was still a cool guy. He was a cool dude. He got his fair share <laughs> a little. But I met this other dude, uh, my homeboy, uh, Mash, his dad. Man, that dude, player for real. He had, two, he had a baddie with him. His dad looked so young. I thought it was his brother. So he came in. He had a girl with him. Another girl, he used to came in. And then it's like he had two girls he was messing with at the same time. They're keeping it player. We went to this hood thing. But now nah, he was just dropping off gems, just dropping off gems, just saying like, he was like, yeah, you young, man. Just have fun. You know what I'm saying? Don't be trying to be tied down. Like, you find a girl that's for you, you know what I'm saying? You're going to know she's for you. And then you're not going to want to entertain nobody else. But you got to realize, girls be having three or four guys at a time. That's fast. No cap. So it's like, if she tell you she the one. <laughs> I've, I've learned I've learned that. Yeah. I, learned, I learned that, like, over the last month or so. Oh, girls be having multiple. They, you may be their favorite, but they got multiple girls. So in my and my my uh, my girl told me that too. Yeah, no, I've been I've been through that. Like you start thinking, oh, I'm the one. She like me. She you may be her favorite, but you're not her only one. 
So you start thinking you the only it's one. It's like a leaderboard. This shit, it moves. Yeah, it moves, man. You get a yeah. roster. You know what I'm saying? You're doing good. You get that max contract, <laughs> that two-year contract. <laughs> but then you start, you go from dropping 22 points to eight points. Nigga, you going to Cleveland. Hey. Yeah. And it don't matter if you get paid max in Cleveland. Nah, you're you're still in Cleveland. <laughs> Cleveland. You pooping with Kevin Love. <laughs> Hey, and that's the wrong Kevin. You gonna be hooping with no cap in the wrong with the, city. With the ramp, yes, facts. Um, it is what it is.